okay? He's not dealing with none of these people that's part of this world, all right? What's that scripture that shows the rich in faith? Yeah. Yeah, I got it. James 2 and uh, oh, y'all just start 2 and 1. My brethren, have not the faith of our Lord, Yahweh Shai Mashiach, the Lord of glory, with respect the person. Right? Because in this world, don't nobody respect you unless what? Unless you got money. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, if you ain't got a big bank account, you don't get no respect. They look at you like you a bum. Like, you need to get your life together. <laughs> and man, it's all a fucking illusion. All your money and all your riches is all illusion. That goddamn hologram. That shit is bullshit. Your little, your little bank account is bullshit. Just numbers on a computer screen. That shit could be erased and deleted. And straight, your bank account gonna get deleted. Hey, that's gonna happen too. Hey, show you yep. how uh, the fucking uh, hackers is going in there to the banks and taking everybody's money out. Man. Right. Get that bell and kick in. Just wait. So all your little money is bullshit. Your, your little happy life is bullshit. This whole world is bullshit. Okay? They're gonna push a reset button on everybody. So, yeah, the mo yeah, they're gonna do that. <laughs> and we're gonna be laughing at you. I can't wait, man. Because they'll say something like, uh, we're gonna have plenty, and the uh, enemy uh, gonna be jealous or envious or something like that. We're gonna have plenty, man. Yeah. And they're gonna be, they gonna, they, they, they gonna be uh, in need. Something like that. I mean, you can look at even in this level. Because you can have a rich man have millions of dollars and a poor man have nothing, but the poor man can live to be 90 years old and the rich man die at 50 or tw die at 20. So, so who had, so who was richer? Who, who, you know what I mean? You know, so you, money is bullshit. Like they say, uh, money does not buy happiness. It's all, it's all an illusion. It's a game. They say that old fucking hip hop of and they always, they always pissed him, man. Like, y'all got all this fucking always money. Fight, always fight, yo. It you won't know, fulfill you. It ain't never happened. Yeah, I'm like, man, they out here fucked up. They over here worried about some bullshit. That's Jake between the lottery for 20 million. And he's broke for two years. He's just constantly buying shit and finding this. He's miserable. Let me read this real quick. Oh, uh, well, you got some? I can yeah, read I this real quick. All right, uh, this is James 2 and 2. For they come unto your assembly a man with a gold ring and goodly apparel, and there come also a poor man in vow raiment. And if you have respect to him to wear the gay clothing, gay doesn't mean a homosexual, it means nice, it means happy. And say unto him, sit down here in a good place and say to the poor, stand out there or sit under my footstool. Are you not then partial in yourselves and become judges of evil thoughts? Hearken, my beloved brethren, have not the Most High chosen the poor of this world, rich in faith, and heirs of the kingdom which he hath promised to them that love him? But ye have despised the poor. Do not rich men oppress you and draw you before the judgment seats? Do they not blasphemy that, that worthy name by the which ye are called? If you fulfill the royal law according to the scripture, Thou shalt love thy neighbor as thyself and do well. See that? You're supposed to look. They don't love their neighbor as thyself. They didn't look down upon you if you ain't got uh, if you ain't got no money in this world. If you if you got a beat up car, they make fun of you. They spit on you. Man, that's why I fuck this world, man. And fuck the people in it. James 4 and 4. You adulterers and adulterers. Know ye, know ye not that the friendship of the world is an enemy, an enemy with God? Whoso therefore will be a friend of this world is an enemy of Yahweh. Yeah, we enemies of this world. That's why we out here, we out here cursing this world out through the spirit of the Lord. The, the hell with this world, this raggedy ass world. It's all about some materialistic bullshit. Don't nobody show you no love unless you got money. Unless you dress a nice, looking good. That's why you go to a job interview. Make sure you wear your best clothes. You gotta wear a suit and tie. Fuck that faggot shit, suit and tie. Only a little faggot little bitch is gonna wear a suit and tie and dress up. Looking like a, uh, yeah, looking like an Uncle Tom. Fuck out of here with that shit, bro. Pleasing these people. Who, who the hell wanna please a 
please a piece of shit, a cockroach. But like, I'm gonna go and press a roach, and press a slave, the scum of the earth. John 15, 18. If the world hates you, you know that it hated me before it hated you. If you were of the world, the world would love its own. But because you are not of the world, but I have chosen you out of the world, therefore the world hated you. That's why the world hates us. Because you know what we say is true. Because we just saying what the Lord said. And every word of the Most High is pure. And every word of the world is filth. Everything, if you ain't speaking out this book, it, right. it ain't nothing but vomit coming out your mouth. Right. The right way. Right, the right way. Because <laughs> you know, this world ain't got nothing to offer you. They can give you a good job, money, riches, but that's it. A bunch of material bullshit is all they can give you. Nothing's going to fulfill your spirit and your soul. Well, you do have a little pleasure to get your boy. That's it. That's pretty much it. What's it going to do for you? What's that? Be fucking mad at you every day. Well, you, you got more trash in your house. You got two bonds here every day I wake up and ask myself, if life's worth living, that's how you That's how you feel, you know? You ain't supposed to just wake up every day and this is not your rest. Yeah. Like I said, you gotta be you gotta be uh you gotta be messed up in the head that be enjoying this world. Look at this world, man. They they turn a forest into a desert wasteland, pour concrete all over the earth, chop all the trees down, poisoning the water, oppressing the poor people. In America, to, if you want to get rich and be successful in America, how do you do that? You got to rob, steal, lie, cheat. Look at Donald Trump. He's the president. The biggest thief, fraud on the planet. He's a big piece of shit. So to get ahead in America, you got to be a piece of shit. That's the only way you The only way you can get ahead in this country is to be a big piece of shit. It's the only way. You ain't going to get ahead being a nice guy. Nice guys finish last. Everybody know that. You ain't gonna get ahead in this country by being honest. That's not how it works. First John 2 and 16. That's why the most already cursed you. First John 2 and 16. For all that is in the world, the lust of the flesh, and the lust of the eyes, and the pride of life. It's not the Father, but it's of the world. Hey, start back up to 215. First John. <laughs> Why was you your white Bible? Yeah, I got it up there. Yeah, I'm proud. I gave you that Bible. <laughs> I'm reading that whole thing. <laughs> and, 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 and the phone would be failing you, so they'd be freezing up. <laughs> they do, yeah, the cold weather effect until it makes them freeze up. So. First John 2 and 15. Yeah, because you got to read the whole thing right there. First John 2 and 15. <laughs> Love got, not. Oh, so like, you, got, you got highlight scriptures in there, huh? Like a real, like a real Bible. That's weird. <laughs> That's weird. First John 2 and 15. Love not the world. Neither the things that are, in, that are in the world. Oh, but people say God is all love. But God, God y'all, he said don't love this world. It's a, this world is evil. Especially America is definitely evil. America is the kingdom of Satan. So how you gonna love Satan? That don't make no sense. Go ahead. If any man love the world, the, the world, the love of the Father is not in him. So if you love this world, if you a love America, you a great American, the love of the Father is not in you. God does not love you. He hates you. That's a fact. It's in the Bible. For all that is in the world, the lust of the flesh, and the lust of the eyes, and the pride of life is not the Father, but is of the world. That's all you see. America is all about the love of the flesh. It's all about cardinality, okay? That's what Christmas, Christmas is all about fulfilling the flesh, all about giving people presents, you know, getting presents, decorating everything. That's the lust of the eyes, decorating the Christmas tree. And the Christmas tree is a devil worshiping. All, all them people dressing on nice, trying to have the flyest gear. That's all the lust of the flesh, the lust of the eyes. Women walking down the street looking like strippers. 
I mean, is we at the bus stop or is we at the, at the strip club? Where are we at? You know what I mean? Proverbs 13 and 13. Whoso despise the word, whoso despise the word shall be destroyed. Hey, if you want to say, raise your hand if you want to speak. Be quiet. Go ahead. Proverbs 13 and 13. Whoever despises the word, shall, whoever despises the word, shall that, be. I, yeah, the description said. Wait, talking about women. The scripture says. Uh, let me get the scripture. I was gonna say there shall be no whores of the daughter of Israel. The scripture said there shall be no whores of the daughter of Israel. So you're supposed to read that to the daughters of Israel. So, so, and if you despise that scripture, please read that. Whoever despises the word shall be destroyed. So, whoever despises the word, which is the Holy Bible shall be destroyed but he that fears the commandment shall be rewarded so if you fear that commandment which says there should be no whores of the daughter of israel what you'll be rewarded and if you teach that to your children you're going to be rewarded go ahead <laughs> it's second chronicles 15 and 13. whosoever will not seek yahweh god of israel so whoever so, sorry, so whoever will not seek yahweh which is the god's name in hebrew Read that. Should be put to death, whether small or great, whether man or woman. There you go. There's a woman standing here. She don't see the most size. Read it again. Read it again. You don't know Second the Bible. Chronicles, Second Chronicles 15 and 13. It says that whosoever will not seek Yahweh, God of Israel, shall be put to death, whether small or great, whether man or woman. Whether man or woman.